Hi everyone. In this video, we will be discussing about the Great Famine or the Irish Potato Famine. This unfortunate situation occurred in Ireland from 1845 to 1849 due to the failure of potato crops in these years. So let us first understand the reason or the background. The potato was a staple crop of Ireland. It was a nutritious and calorie dense crop. and was easy to grow in the irish soil therefore there was a heavy reliance on just one or two types of potato crops so basically it reduced the variety of potatoes which could prevent the crop reduction from diseases that is the reason that the irish became vulnerable to famine what happened in 1845 was that a strain of water mold phytophthora infestans that causes late blight in potatoes arrived in Ireland from North America when plants come in contact with it they get infected with it and lesions appears on leaves stem and a spore producing structure may also appear potato tubers also get infected moreover fungi and bacteria start invading potato and the rotting starts what could stop the spread of phytophthora is a hot dry weather but in 1845 ireland had cool and moist weather this allowed the blight to thrive instead therefore potato crop started rotting in the fields now let us see the relief efforts done by the government initially the conservative prime minister mr robert peel allowed the export of grains from ireland to great britain in order to uplift the economy He also authorized the import of corn fields from United States, but the problem was that the Irish disliked the imported corn meal, and that led to nutritional deficiencies. The next government of Lord John Russell maintained somewhat same approach, but he shifted the financial burden to Irish landowners. There was a setback in the sense that the tenant farmers were unable to pay their rents. and therefore the landlord soon ran out of funds so this led to the eviction of poor farmers of ireland with literally no money in hand and no food to eat this distress intensified the resentment of people towards their governments the direct consequence of the famine was that the ireland's population had fallen from 8.4 million in 1844 to 6.6 million by 1851 Moreover, between these years, about 49% of the immigrants who moved to the U.S. were Irish. Ireland's population continued to decline in the following decades because of immigration and lower birth rates. So this was all about the Great Famine. Thank you so much for watching this video. Do like, share, and subscribe to Think Curious. Have a good day.